Milk is a dietary staple for many people around the world, consumed in various forms such as whole, skim, or low-fat milk. It is a rich source of calcium, protein, and vitamins D and B12. However, the consumption of milk has also been linked to various health issues, one of which is diabetes. In this video, we will explore the relationship between milk consumption and diabetes, backed by scientific studies. Milk Nutrition Dairy is important for your diet because it's an excellent source of calcium. But it may also be high in fat and carbs, making it risky for people with diabetes. Diabetes and high-fat diets raise your risk of cardiovascular disease. By managing the fat in your diet, you can help lower this risk. Keep in mind that you want to cut unhealthy fats while eating a good amount of healthy fats. Good fats help you manage your diabetes. Is milk an option for people with diabetes? Many people have childhood memories of their parents urging them to drink milk. When you're a child, you typically have to drink whatever milk your parents provided for you. It may have been a more traditional option such as whole milk or an alternative such as almond milk. Now that you're the one doing the choice, you can pick the best type of milk for you. If you have diabetes, you probably already know that there are lots of choices when it comes to milk and milk alternatives. The link between milk and diabetes. Several studies have investigated the relationship between milk consumption and diabetes. One study conducted in Finland followed over 3,000 men and women for 19 years and found that those who consumed more than 200 milliliters of milk per day had a higher risk of developing type 2 diabetes compared to those who consumed less than 100 milliliters per day. The researchers suggested that the lactose, or milk sugar, in milk may contribute to insulin resistance, leading to type 2 diabetes. Another study published in the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition found that consuming dairy products, including milk, was associated with a higher risk of developing type 2 diabetes in women. The researchers followed over 37,000 women for 10 years and found that those who consumed the most dairy products had a 13% higher risk of developing type 2 diabetes compared to those who consumed the least. A study published in the Journal of Nutrition and Metabolism investigated the relationship between milk intake and insulin resistance in overweight and obese adolescents. The researchers found that consuming high amounts of milk was associated with insulin resistance, which is a precursor to type 2 diabetes. These studies suggest that there may be a link between milk consumption and diabetes, particularly type 2 diabetes. However, more research is needed to fully understand the relationship between the two dietary needs for people with diabetes. People with diabetes are not able to make or use insulin effectively. Insulin is a hormone that helps regulate blood sugar. When insulin isn't doing its job efficiently, blood sugar levels can spike. There are two main types of diabetes, type 1 and type 2. No matter which type you have, managing your carbohydrate intake is important. Carb counting is often recommended for people living with diabetes. Sugar is one type of carbohydrate and experts do recommend limiting added sugars for overall health. People with diabetes may also have high cholesterol or triglycerides in their blood. High levels of these fats are associated with an increased risk of heart disease. Keeping an eye on some types of saturated fat including trans fat content in your diet can be beneficial. However, current research suggests that saturated fat in dairy is not associated with heart disease. Diabetes can also make some people more susceptible to bone fractures. A diet high in calcium can help keep bones strong. One way to do this is by drinking milk daily. Adding calcium-rich milk to your diet may take a bit of planning. A good eating plan would be one that is individualized to meet nutrition needs and takes into account food preferences and any food intolerances. The role of milk fat. One potential factor that may contribute to the link between milk consumption and diabetes is milk fat. Milk fat is a source of saturated fat, which has been linked to insulin resistance and type 2 diabetes. A study published in the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition found that higher intakes of total dairy fat were associated with a higher risk of developing type 2 diabetes. The researchers followed over 27,000 adults for 14 years and found that those who consumed the most dairy fat had a 44% higher risk of developing type 2 diabetes compared to those who consumed the least. Another study published in the European Journal of Nutrition investigated the relationship between different types of dairy products and type 2 diabetes risk. The researchers found that consuming high-fat dairy products, such as whole milk, was associated with a higher risk of developing type 2 diabetes. In contrast, consuming low-fat dairy products, such as skim milk, was not associated with an increased risk. These studies suggest that consuming high amounts of milk fat may increase the risk of developing type 2 diabetes. Choosing low-fat dairy products may be a healthier option for those at risk of developing diabetes. The Role of Milk Protein Milk is a rich source of protein, 
which is important for the growth and repair of the body. However, some studies have suggested that consuming high amounts of milk protein may also contribute to the development of diabetes. A study published in the Journal of Nutrition found that consuming high amounts of milk protein was associated with an increased risk of developing type 2 diabetes in men. The researchers followed over 29,000 men for 12 years and found that those who consumed the most milk protein had a 34% higher risk of developing type 2 diabetes compared to those who consumed the least. Another study published in the Journal of Dairy Science found that consuming high amounts of milk protein was associated with insulin resistance and higher blood sugar levels in overweight and obese individuals. The researchers suggested that the high content of branched-chain amino acids in milk protein may contribute to insulin resistance and diabetes. These studies suggest that consuming high amounts of milk protein may increase the risk of developing type 2 diabetes. However, more research is needed to fully understand the role of milk protein in diabetes development. Alternatives to milk For those concerned about the potential link between milk consumption and diabetes, there are several alternatives to milk that can provide similar nutrients. Some options include Soy milk Soy milk is a plant-based milk that is rich in protein and fortified with calcium and vitamin D. It is also low in saturated fat and lactose, making it a good option for those with lactose intolerance or concerns about milk fat. Almond milk Almond milk is a nut-based milk that is low in calories and saturated fat. It is also a good source of vitamin E and calcium. Coconut milk Coconut milk is plant-based milk that is rich in flavor and texture. However, it is also high in saturated fat, so it should be consumed in moderation. Oat milk Oat milk is a plant-based milk that is rich in fiber and low in saturated fat. It is also a good source of vitamin D and calcium. The link between milk consumption and diabetes is a complex issue that requires more research to fully understand. However, several studies suggest that consuming high amounts of milk, particularly whole milk, may increase the risk of developing type 2 diabetes. Milk fat and protein may also play a role in diabetes development. For those concerned about the potential link between milk consumption and diabetes, there are several alternatives to milk that can provide similar nutrients. Soy milk, almond milk, coconut milk, and oat milk are all good options. It is important to note that the research on the link between milk consumption and diabetes is not conclusive, and individual factors such as genetics, lifestyle, and diet may also play a role in diabetes development. It is important to consult with a healthcare professional before making any significant changes to your diet or lifestyle. If you enjoyed this video, kindly press the like button. Also don't forget to subscribe with notifications on, so that you don't miss out on videos like this. Thank you for watching.